Welcome back, everyone. It's been what almost a year since we were here since I we did the so, yeah. since we did the stable tour. More than a year, I think. More. It's we, the video. Firstly, we want to thank you all for the feedback. We had m over a million views, which is incredible. Uh, and since we had such great feedback, we came back to do something we promised to show you guys, which is well. There's going to be a big horse swap, so Patrick will ride one of your horses and you are going to ride one of Patrick's. And I got no clue what kind of horse you will ride, but no, I'm I sure also it's don't going know. to be fun. I don't know, but last time I was here, Patrick was like, you know what, it'd be really fun if we swapped horses. And you have to bring your riding pants and I put you on my best horse and let's do like a, a ride off. We'll do a horse swap. <laughs> yeah, a horse, <laughs> we'll do a horse swap. So I brought one of my very own Spanish horses. He's in here. Um, Has he ever seen him? No, he's never seen him. Uh, and I brought him Porio, so uh, yeah. he's a I'm five-year-old, he's a stallion, he's a little bit fiery, uh, but I know Patrick will do more than good enough, but I'm so curious to see someone else on him. Patrick's around the corner, let's go say hi, and then we can take him out and get his first uh, impression. Let's see if he's nervous. Yeah, I'm nervous. I hope <laughs> he likes him. Okay, let's go. Hello. Nice to see you guys again. Yeah, we made it. <laughs> you made it's it so through nice everything. It's so nice to be back. Yeah. It's like coming home. <laughs> Except well, you, our you, home doesn't look like this. You're welcome to stay. <laughs> and this <laughs> time we brought a little bit more. I know, this time we have a little present for you. Ooh, uh, we nice have a, a Spanish present. I feel like last time when you were like, it'd be nice to do a swap. We never actually imagined it would happen. <laughs> and well, now we're here. <laughs> it's really cool, I have to say. And I also yeah. have a box, you know, if I like him, I will just keep him. Okay, <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> I have to tell you though, he is like my baby. So, uh -oh. so if I'm you want to keep him, you also need an extra house. I yeah, yeah extra very, house. so if he comes, I come. I don't uh, mind that. So okay, if, okay. if that works, that works. But I want to take him off the truck and get your first impressions and then I can tell you a little bit about him when we're uh, in the indoor and I'd before you get on. I'd love okay. to. I'm really excited actually. Do you have any background with Spanish horses, um, PREs at all? I've never ridden one. It's going to be really interesting. I'm actually really looking okay. forward to it to see if it's such a big difference. Yeah. I always seen it on the shows because some obviously at the Olympics have been a couple of PRE horses in and I always love their attitude to work. They always yeah. like and they want to go but they seem really kind yeah and i think that's the best combination when you have a horse that is kind and still yeah. willing to do the job so and i think they're kind of awake but not crazy no exactly yeah. Yeah. emporio is a little switched on he's a stallion he's very <laughs> reactive to other horses but he's super <laughs> Just, safe okay i put some glue on you know my parents <laughs> yeah. and stuff just in case you know yeah. so i can like but he's got some power and i really feel i wonder what you think but i think he could be a I think he will turn into a Grand Prix horse eventually. I feel like he has that trainability and that little specialness about him, but I'm very biased because he's my baby. But <laughs> let, I'll get him out and then you can uh, tell me what you think. He's not the biggest one I have, okay. but we'll have to get the big one out next time when he's... Uh, okay, so I will shorten the stirrups. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Wow. It's got a neck enough though. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, you, you can know. always sit on the neck. Yeah, I can always like, and it's very nice <laughs> uphill. So I doesn't, you know, I always think like, so I had also quite small horses in my career, but as long as they have a big front, yeah, it, it looks normally does. It, okay. Oh, wow. Hey. So he's got lots of hair for you as well. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Very nice small head. Hi. He's sweet though. <laughs> so kind of traditional PRE, big neck, compact. Yeah. Um, I would say he's a little bit leggier than most PREs, okay. um, but it's pretty standard. And he comes from um, the kind of Cardenas lines, which is where Fuego came from. So ah, he's got the Fuego. same uh, <laughs> he's got the same bloodlines as Fuego. That's I'll get him ready so he's nice and uh, and brushed fixed. and pretty. <laughs> And then if you want to wait for us in the indoor, do you want me to warm them up first or do you, do you want to? I think, you know, I just want to make sure because, you know, we have the Olympics this year. So yeah. if you start, okay. then I see that it's really safe and then okay. I can get on. Okay, perfect. I'll get him ready then and then we'll perfect. see you in the indoor. I'll see you in a minute, okay. guys. Okay, let's go. You know what I did that I actually really regret? I clipped the bottom of Emporio's legs and then they looked so discolored that I ended up having to try and clip up and blend it, but it's full of lines. <laughs> so I'm gonna be it. bandaging up to here. So <laughs> we hopefully don't see that. But no, I'm not too nervous because 
the great thing about Emporio is that he's never like disappointed me. He's he always comes through. So I, I mean, hope... are you more nervous for him to get on Emporio or for you to ride? His no, horse? I'm nervous to get on his horse. Yes, sir. I mean, did you? <laughs> I don't know. The horses he has are amazing, and he's such an amazing rider. So I hope the horse doesn't go, huh? Who's this? <laughs> who this? Yeah, who this? But it um. It'll be fine. It'll be okay. I'm just nervously brushing this tail until it like falls out. <laughs> Wonder if Patrick will have the same uh, stirrup length as me. I think he has. I don't know, very. He's long, long legs. like he's tall, and he has long legs. So. Oh, definitely not shorter than you. No. Emporio, we just have to do what we do at home. Except we're three hours away and we're in front of an Olympiad, okay? Okay, let's go, we're ready. We're off. I hope he gives me a few tips. Like I know I'm gonna be riding first, but I hope Patrick's still like less inside rain. <laughs> you don't need that much flexion, which is my uh, I can't biggest believe, struggle. No, I can't believe, but I really will not even think because he never rode at PRE. I know, and, it, and, and Emporio is like true PRE. Like, Sereno's already a bit of a mix, but Emporio is like true PRE. We're Welcome all ready. <laughs> Come in. We tacked up your Thank horse. God you're here. I've been eating so much candy, I tell you. <laughs> it's like candy heaven. It's not a huge fan of boots. Ow. <laughs> It's like the Piaf trick. <laughs> yeah. This is how you get more hind leg. This you is how you nice get more hind leg, you know, it just gets the on. boots on. Oh, you're already becoming his best friend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but we, I always start with sugar and finish with sugar, <laughs> yeah. you know, or a little treat of some sort of shape, you know. It's always good when they, when they get some sort of a encouragement when they start. So you start off with a positive note. And I have to say, when you, I used to have quite a couple of like bit grumpy horses when they come in. Mm. And then after I started giving them always, they were always like happier when they came in, like <laughs> Yeah, they had like a nice positive yeah, association. Yeah. So that's why I always start with it. So I think my plan of attack is I'm going to try and ride for the least amount of time possible. <laughs> so you can't uh, okay, so go in on me. One round and <laughs> yeah. take your good now. I'm like, um, it's not lame. <laughs> Feels great. Yeah, go ahead. Great. Take, take it. Um, well, I was expecting the whole Grand Prix. Uh, no, no, not at oh. all. But uh, just so you know, we've been playing a little bit like with the half pass. He started the changes a little bit. Okay. Um, and then the lateral shoulder in and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But I'm just going to have a feel of how he is. Mm -hmm. And then I think you can have a play with all okay. that stuff. I don't want to do too much. No, you start and I just, I just, you know, yeah. I just check a bit. It's always nice for me to also have like a little bit of a look how you, you know, how you ride him, how you feel, how he is, how... You know, it's always a different new horse, different yeah. horse. You always have to sort of like try to feel into him and see, okay, what, you know, what can I do? What is, what is the sort of good things? What can we work on? It's, I always try to see the whole picture and see, okay, what is it that we want to achieve today? Yeah. I'll make my, uh, make my way. You made your grand debut on, on my soil here. Oh my God, I know. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I can't believe I, uh, I saw the arena the first time and now I'm riding in it. That's uh, crazy. I would say his walk is his weakest pace, as most PREs are. They get a bit stuck. They don't have a great overtrack. And I think his canter is his best. But I just, I wonder what you think. And then okay, I'll just no take worries. it easy at first and, uh, and see. And I rode on him, on him a few times, but it's, everything moves, I think. Everything moves. Like, That's normally quite good if everything <laughs> moves. <laughs> That's so when you start, like, give him a little bit longer reins. So, just do a couple of like smaller circles. So, just give him a little bit more rain, just give him a little bit time. Slowly walking. Easy. So, good, that's good. Oh, so, that's good. Because I think with him, you don't need to do too fast from the movement. You need actually to like get the walk quite a little bit slower. Then he doesn't have to overtrack so much. He just has to walk a bit more relaxed. Yeah. Then it also will be better from the walk here. So, good, slowly, not too fast. Super. And then just trots easy out of that. Good, that's good. It's a little bit the same thing here, like get the trot like in a nice, easy, in the beginning he doesn't have to be like fancy at all. 
just so that he can warm up in his body, huh? This is good. So, and you can get the neck a little bit longer. There, that's it. So that he's in a nice balance for you, that he starts taking a soft, easy step. There, that's good. Not deeper than that. Now he gets a bit deep. There, that's good. Just so he keeps his balance in the neck. So, good. So, not too fast. So, just very, it doesn't matter if it doesn't look so much in the beginning. It's more important for me, it's like going to the gym a bit yourself. You have to like warm up in a, in, a, in a quiet rhythm before you can start doing more. This is nice. Good. I, I, I have to say, and I think, you know, you did a good job warming up for me here too. And, you know, <laughs> if I haven't instructed you good enough now, then it's my own fault. So then it should be okay. Okay, let's oh, see how you go. I think I need two up. Two up? Yep. Okay, I can do that. I told you you had long legs. <laughs> But how tall are you? You're also 185. tall. 185. Oh, I'm 191. Hey. Okay, yeah. So You're that, 191. That makes sense. Holy but my brother's 205. I no told way. Yeah. <laughs> First impression is that he's very happy. <laughs> the ears are in front. It's a big neck, right? <laughs> it's a very big neck. Oh. Oh. He's a little goey. Oh. But that's a good thing. Oh. It suits you, Patrick. <laughs> Maybe I should. Oh, good boy. But what I really like is this, like, you know, always goey, huh? But for me, it's like always when I ride a horse, I always think how I can develop it as a dressage horse. I yeah. don't think about that it's he's a PRE or he's a, you know, Nordic, Swedish horse or whatever he is. I just want to ride and try to do the, the best I can with the horse I have. Good. Who would have ever thought that a horse I bought in Spain as a three-year-old would be ridden by Patrick Kittle? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> things just turn out a certain oh. way sometimes oh good it's funny huh how that's but that's how it goes you yeah know? like and we just train and do our thing oh Boop. good good boy for me it's also really important to like just get to know the new horse you know and just see okay what can i do to develop him how can i get him on my side yeah good does the walk feel different compared to like one of your horses? No, it doesn't. It just feels a bit like it's a bit faster. You know what I mean? Like it's a bit faster from the walk. Yeah. But what I do now is that I just want to have him walking in my speed so that I can just give the rein and he can walk around but not go too fast. So I do a little bit like a stop. Just make him wait a bit. He can look a bit. And then pat, and then just I just want to walk him out so that I can give the rein, but he doesn't walk faster. Yeah. Good. So, so crazy to see someone else on him again. Oh, I know. And then Good. it's magic, of course. But <laughs> the added element. No pressure. Oh. oh. I just this is like also what I do with my own like. They, they, especially when I don't know them, I just need to take time to get to know him and not just, you know, start. The first thing I do is to just, you know, ask him for stuff, but yeah. actually like just get for me like a good relationship with him and not stress that he feels, okay, it's a new guy, it's a new rider. Okay, what can I do with him? Yeah. And I just like, good boy. And I just like to do this, a couple of small, small half holes that I can just make sure that he's like not going away too fast for me, a little bit, little bit like you and I train as well. Yeah, because he does have that thing, he just wants to go. Yeah. Like he's got that, and that's something we worked on heavily and it's getting better, but it's gonna be something that I'll have to keep, I think, uh, keep up with him for a while and just be like, just, you know, we don't need 120%, we just need- No, but it's also like, it's a positive thing that he wants to go. And the thing is that you need to use the good boy, there, that's good. You need to use the positive energy to get him like in a good way. Yeah. And so the, the energy forwards is awesome, which he really need. And then you just have to make sure that you like train him so that he's like, just waits for you and doesn't run too fast or, you know, just walks in a nice rhythm. So then when I just start, I just wanna, cause it's like for sure, like a different rhythm for me as well. So I just have to like, <laughs> oh my God, it started. <laughs> And I just need to like, for me, good. It's the oh, same thing there. Like... I don't want him to go too fast. I just want him to 
Good. That looks nice. So, you know, just in like one nice rhythm for me as well. And then stay a little bit in counter canter. It's also really good exercise to get that hind leg <laughs> under. You can try a change if you want, if you feel like it. <laughs> I can see, try. See how it goes. They're not, they're not fully there yet, but he tries. Good. Oh, good. <laughs> It's expressive. Oh. <laughs> Very, but I mean, it's the same thing there. He wants to like help you, you know? Yeah. So sit here again, not go away. Has to wait. Good. Oh, I thought I was going to change back. So. Oh. <laughs> one, 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 one. <laughs> but you feel big steps. So good to see how he can still get yeah. in like so. more without putting even like pressure on and he's sitting so much better now yeah he's sitting much better now much better also here to the right's getting much better now that's nice that's super nice so big guy <laughs> now it's big guy's time now it's up to you to do a good job on this one i know i won't do as good of a job as you but you gave me such good guidance before that i feel confident enough that i won't well, maybe you do even a better <laughs> job well, okay, let's not I get heard Australia ahead of has three places for the Olympics next year. Okay, okay, okay. well, we'll Shop see on. how it goes then. Good boy. Be nice with me. <laughs> it would be a real 2020 if I fell off and broke something. Oh yeah, nah. That's the don't. rhythm. That's the rhythm of this year. <laughs> there you go, my friend. Okay, good boy. Good boy. We'll take it nice and easy. Perfect. Does it feel? Good. Good. Good for steps. Yeah, steps good. feel great. Perfection. Wow, <laughs> very different on top of him. <laughs> it's a tiny bit bigger. It's a good size for you though. Yeah, this reminds me more of my other two. Yep, it's like... But I'm sure that he'll be uh, different in the way he moves and feels. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good boy. So, so just start like easy, you know, just walk around. Okay. I'm so thrown by the neck because I just came from mine and this is such a beautiful, elegant neck <laughs> and I've come from like a full war horse. <laughs> and the walk feels like, like butter for the people yeah. who can't feel it. Obviously it's big, it's soft, it's even, it's so comfy. Yeah, it's really, really like, it has a super nice walk. This is very good, super. And then you just, from this, you start trotting a little bit. Okay. Oh, really good. Yeah, exactly. This is very good. So that you feel that you have him exactly there, not deeper. Little bit up, there, that's perfect. So that there, this is good. Very good. So that you feel that it doesn't go too deep on the hand. He has to stay nicely up front of you, there. Even if it's lower, he still has to be in front. It's good. Yeah, exactly. Oh, this is good. Super. Cool. This, that's perfect. I mean, it's the first ride, so, but this is very good. This is actually good. He's soft, he's round, but he's not like too short and too low. So, very nice. Super good. Good boy. Then a little bit through and then we change the rain. Super good, Matt. Really nice. Sit really well here too now. Very good. This is really good. A little bit bending to the left. Nice. That's super. Really good. Then really good. And then just do the change, do it to the other side. Nice. Very good. Super here, hey? Good. So, super. Go down your hands so that you feel, there you go. Good. Very good. Very good, nice bending to the right without coming too deep. Now it's a little bit too deep again. There. He's that. so soft that I just have to be so careful with my position and yeah. uh, my hands. Good. But he still takes the contact to the hand, which yeah, I, you absolutely. know, they have to be soft, but they still have to take contact. So, yeah, well, good. Spend a bit to the inside, super. And then you do a little bit of canter. Oh, so, that's nice. Okay, I'll so, do a bit of canter. 
I'm just scared. Sit, <laughs> just sit down a bit there and then just give the aid. Super. Very good. And also with him, exactly as with your horse, think big steps, huh? Super, big step. That's awesome. Good. Very good. This is really good. Good. Sitting really well here. Very good. Super. Straight. So, really nice. Shoulder not too fast. So, control. That's very good. Inside leg, control. Super good. Good. This is very good. So good. Then do a little bit of trot. Easy. So ho. Nice. Super transition. You can stay sitting. And we just change the rein. We do the canter the other side. Nice. Oh, so nice the sitting trot. <laughs> well, he's much more balanced, isn't he? <laughs> yeah, he is very balanced. So we're going to try a little bit PF massage. Oh, God. Okay. I think that I should know a little bit more about what I'm doing. Yeah. It's so, it's just even keeping that straightness with the changes because there's so much going on. And then on top of it, you got to stay straight. You got to stay in the same tempo. The you can't go too deep. There's so much going on. I got to give you a short, just a tiny little bit to help with the whip because it's not quite easy. Just in the beginning to see if you, because you're the first one doing it, like, you know what I mean? So we just. No problem. Good boy. Okay. Just Should I go. change the whip over to the yep. other side? You can you can have it on whatever. Okay. I'll leave it this side then. Yeah. Then just come back a bit. So that you feel like you like this is good. Super oh, good. He's ready. Good, 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 good. Already good. Super, super good. Wow. You got a talent for this, my friend. So this is good. Sit. Super, super. Good, really good. Through the neck. That's super good. So, yeah, doesn't matter. So, sit through the neck. Super, sit, sit. Good. Good. Good, super. Sit, sit through the neck. So, you get there. That's it. And then you go to the PF from this. This is super. And sit on the spot. Super, 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 super. Pierre, I never ridden that much and it's been really cool and he was such a good boy to ride. Yeah. And it's such a different feeling for me and I hope also like really when you different. sat on my horse, oh, that it was so the same thing, you know, it's a different feeling yeah. but equally pleasurable, you Absolutely. know what I mean? It's Something like, to love about both. Exactly. And uh, okay. it's, I really hope we can do stuff in the future, which I know we will. Yeah. And It'll I hope fun. everyone that watches this enjoys this as much as we did. Yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed, took something away, learned something as well. Uh, thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye. Ciao.